Welcome everybody to Light Place Tower of Heaven. Now I'm going to take off because I have previously recorded this, but one, I have XSplit to have the stream mode, my 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 function for streaming as F5, and I had used F5 to um, refresh the page of the game. And it absolutely recorded no visuals whatsoever. And on top of that, uh, let me double check something before I even freaking flip tables at all whatsoever. Uh, blah, blah, blah. hold on. Is it recording my voice? Yes, it is. Now it's recording my voice. This is this entire time I've been talking for like about an hour of gameplay footage, and it it just did not record anything at all whatsoever. Complete fail. Anyways, um, so yeah, I'm playing Tower of Heaven, and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna play play a new game. That way you can see what's going on. Morning over race. Yes, yes, yes. I didn't get that far. Press space to proceed. What's this? Yet another soul seeks to scale my tower. Welcome, young one. Perhaps you do not realize the danger in what you are attempting. If you truly wish to ascend this tower and claim its reward, then make your way to those stairs. But be warned, I have no patience for slow workers. If you cannot reach the top, oh, I said the tower. The stairs to the next floor before the time runs out, I shall smite you. May heaven grant you fortune. Now, scaling this tower wouldn't be all that dangerous if it simply involved climbing stairs, would it? Then again, you probably expected as much. May heaven grant you fortune. Shit. That was close. You'll still have to prove that you're worthy of progressing further. And you better get used to proving yourself, believe me. May heaven grant you fortune? Oh shit. Oh, why did I even jump? What? You're still here. Hmm. I never had to do this, but... In that case, let's make things a bit more amusing. Pick up that tablet in front of you. This is the Book of Laws. Within the walls of the tower, this tower, you must obey what it commands, or I will smite you. I will add new laws to this book when I see fit so that you may be fairly tested of your ability. When I add new laws, all the old laws will still be in effect. You will you may review the laws at any time by pressing ship. May heaven grant you fortune. Oh shit, I, I... Anyways, um so I've been taking this long as break and I'm terribly sorry everybody but um my mental state for the past month for this past month hasn't been the greatest um uh, why did I do that you just wait um shit. uh I'm, I'm not trying to make any is, um, you know, I'm not here to make anybody feel like complete shit or whatever. But mentally, I haven't been myself, and it's kind of hard to like play games if you're not yourself and you're not feeling up to playing anything. Like I forced myself to play Tomb Raider with the PC to stream it.
And, um, yeah, so I haven't been myself to the point that I haven't been really playing any games. And, um, I've been more focusing on watching anime for the time being. <clears throat> You're quite the persistent one, I see. Since this is so easy for you, let's add another rule. Thou shall not touch blocks or walls from the side. This should be funny. Yeah, look what happens. You fucking die. Even your big ass head will like trigger some little shit. Grr. So the pawn chooses to play this game of death with its maker. Have fun with this new rule then. Thou shalt not walk left. You are smarter than I thought. But you don't know what you're getting yourself into. I would try to make your death quick and painless. Oh man. The rolls get like the mo like the most ridiculous thing of all time that you can't even okay, see. Cause the rolls are still in effect like you said. Anyways, so I haven't been in myself for the past month since like the beginning of June, July, I said July, January, <laughs> since like around the beginning of January, oh my god, and so since then I haven't really made any videos, the pretty much recent one I did was the Tomb Raider one, um, that I recorded when I was, um, when I was streaming the game and um, that was it I just pretty much forced myself to play that game and you guys know as far as me playing that game that game is like Pressing zero like kills out the the audio. I don't want that. I like the audio. I like that the songs from this game. Shit. Um, there it goes again. Uh, yeah. Like I've been getting more aggravated with any little thing. You can like tell me the simplest little fucking thing, and I'll get like. Totally pissed off. For stupid little shit. Like, you, you could tell me, like, pie, and I will get freaking pissed off for whatever reason. You will fail sooner or later. You're no different from the rest, despite what you may think. The reward is not meant for mortal hands to claim it. You must first shed your humanity. Okay. Remember I told you about the. Here's one of the bullshit rules. Hold on, one second. Oh my god! Oh, my nose burns. Oh, fuck. Hurts. Better not be getting sick, I swear. This I will give you a new rule. Thou shalt not touch a living thing. May heaven grant you, well, you'll see soon enough. Watch. You're gonna like... 
fucking flip tables. I can't touch those fucking butterflies. I can't touch fucking grass. Oh man, this is the part that I kept getting stuck at. Define me will only bring you closer to your demise. But if you're so sure of yourself, henceforth thou shalt not longer, no longer check the rules. Anyways, yeah, this is the farthest I've gotten, guys. The bullshit rules. See, I can't touch butterflies. So, I haven't been myself and, you know, it, it's affected me a lot. So, right now, I'm trying to see if I could play. And it might hopefully go away the more I play games. And don't even, don't, don't even ask in the comments, oh, what's wrong? Because, quite frankly, I do not even know myself. Like, you see the bullshit that, that, that this, this game is throwing at me? Mariah, Sonia, man. So sexy. Like, give me that face, like, eh, take me. Give me some of that nerve. I'm like, nah. Um. And, I'm not gonna lie, since then, because I haven't been playing any games, I've been watching more and more anime, or I've been keeping up with all the episodes, like, till recent. Like, I'm not gonna lie, I've been keeping up with, uh, with, uh, Kill a Kill, to the most recent one, which is, like, completely fucked up. I'm not gonna lie. It's, like, the most fucked up shit that's been going on in the anime. Oh, by the way, I'm thinking, like, I'm, I'm not, I'm pretty sure you guys noticed it by now. The TVMA that you're gonna see in the upper left-hand corner, uh, yeah, left-hand corner. I'm gonna, like, leave that there if I know I'm gonna, like, uh, that should be, like, all of my videos. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I'm, like, worse than a fucking sailor. I try not to. I, I try not to curse when not needed, you know. But like, cases like this, I can't, man. I can't help but to do it! Cause shit like this happening to me. All of a sudden I'm hungry. And I ate like, almost half, like, a thing of mango. Like, cut up mango. It's really good. Um, I ate two, uh, beef patties. Not big ones, but like small little ones. It was pretty good. Um, and on top of that, I had to like stuff it down my throat, man. Like I only have 15 minutes to eat. By the time you like buy your stuff, by the time you sit down and all that other shit, it's like the most ridiculous thing in my job. So you basically don't even have time to even scratch your ass. Uh, my fault. Um, I've been watching that, I've been watching, uh, what else? An anime called Golden Time. Another one that's completely, like, messed up in the head. Um, recently, My Sister's Unusual. It's pretty freaking funny, but, like, so perverse. You see, that's the furthest I've gotten in this level by the door. 
And then I die exactly in front of the door. I jumped, you stupid shit. Fucking rock muncher, man. So I've been doing that, I've been watching, uh, Kiliko, oh shit. Golden Time, uh, Recently My Sister's Unusual, uh, what else? What the fuck have I been watching? It's more than that, like, I'm trying to remember the rest right now. Oh, Super Sonico! I've been watching Super Sonico, um, the animation, which it came out, another new episode, I'm gonna watch it right after this. Calm me the hell down, because Sonico's kawaii ugu. Like Mariah Carey right now, Mariah Carey's like asking for love and attention. Mariah. Hold on, guys. Okay. Um, Super Sonico. Let's see. What else? I've been trying to watch more anime. Fucking Christ. Um, boobies! Oh! I'm not gonna lie, ladies and gentlemen. I had the most fucking feely moment with, uh, the Disney movie Frozen. Oh, man. That movie so much feels, man. I'm not gonna lie, one of their songs, like, it always brings me to the verge of tears. Oh man. That movie. I love that movie. Shit. Okay, maybe I have to do that technique. Just go back and forth in that, um, little fans of doom and shit. Um, it's a really good movie. I, I highly recommend it to people. Sure, you might get pissed off like my sister did, where there's too many, she considers it too many things, too much songs and singing and shit, but if, you, if you're used to watching stuff like Sweeney Todd or like singing like movies, then you would tolerate the crap out of it. Shit. My mom's ass. How? 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 Um... <laughs> Why? Why don't you love me? Why won't you love me like one of your French girls? Seriously, don't you want me to live now, do you? Let's just like pretend none of this happened, and I'm not even going to get your whatever bullshit you're gonna give me. It better not be like 
a D in the box. Yeah, it better not be a dick in the box, I swear. I think I'm gonna be really, really upset. Maybe I'm supposed to hit up? Hold on. Hold the freaking phone. Whoa, what? Wait, what? No, 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 no. That was unacceptable. Hold on. How the fuck did I die? I'm pretty sure I'm, I'm gonna edit. I'm gonna edit. Uh, edit this video and like figure out how the hell did I die as soon as I reached that block. Was there something I was missing, or maybe there was a hidden thing there? I I don't know. I don't know if something that I could have done or some nonsense like that. I really don't know. Please, game. Anyways, if you want to play this game, I'm going to leave the link down in the uh, description. Um, if you have like a YouTube channel that you, uh, you post videos and stuff. <gasps> Wait, am I pressing shift? I'm going to be really pissed off if I'm, if I'm pressing shift. And I'm not even realizing it. Let me just take my finger away from shift. Hold on, Mariah. I can't give you love right now. Oh, oh God. Why? Oh, yes, Mariah. Let me give you love and attention you need. You cut those Batman ears. Okay. That's enough depth. Hold on, guys. Excuse me, I said... So yeah, um, Rosen, really good. I highly recommend it, even if you're a guy. You know, even if it makes it seem like you're you're gay. I don't care. You need to watch it. If you want feels and you want to like cry your eyes out, like a little bitch, like I was. I'm not gonna lie. I almost cried like a little bitch when I was watching that movie the first time. I was like, oh no. No! The fuel train! Who oh, abort the fucking fuel train? The fuel Oh, I walked! Okay, this time I walked left. Am I supposed to walk? I'm supposed to hop left. Why was he just standing there? Why? What are you doing? I don't even know anymore. Mariah, why are you sniffing? Oh, why are you lick me on my elbow? The fucking Christ. I love you too, Mariah. I died before I even reached the ground. So I pressed left. Oh, 
I don't know what to do, man. I keep getting stuck at this one fucking part, man. What am I supposed to do? Like, suddenly, like, shit out Jesus out of my ass and just say, Hey, Jesus, do you think you, like, fucking saved me? How, how did I... I don't even know what I mean. All I know is I'm losing my voice badly. And, um... Shit. Okay, I'm seriously losing my voice. This is not good. Okay. Yeah, of course. Oh, fucking course. Anyways. Um, oh yeah, cool thing that happened this past Saturday, which was like the 15 or something. Even though it was like the shittiest morning of all time. And how do I, and, and like, I'm, I'm gonna tell you guys something and you're all gonna fucking laugh at me and call me a fucking retard or some shit in the comments. I really don't know and I don't care. But whenever m the newspapers from my job wind up coming in late, I know automatically it's going to be a bad day. But every time, what, I, I'm not even exaggerating. I wish I was exaggerating. I wish I, I was lying. But whenever the newspaper really comes in late, I always wind up having a bad day or a bad morning or whatever. It doesn't matter. But, why am I even talking about Saturday? Now, normally Saturdays are my days off, like, for, it's been a couple of months now that they always gave me Saturdays off for whatever odd reason, but it's fine. I'm fine with that. That way, if I were to, like, game with the guys, hope, you know, hopefully that's very soon, because I only played with them, the, like, the other day, and it was only for, like, a couple of hours. Um, and hopefully once I'm done with this issue that I'm, I'm in right now, this, uh, mental issue that's going on with me, I'm gonna call it a mental issue, yes it is, it is a mental issue if you technically think about it, I'm really losing my voice, oh my god, my throat is like hurting like hell. It's like screaming at me, how the fuck dare you? It's still talking. Anyways, so... Um, Chris Rock happened to be shopping where I work at, um, a little before my shift ended, which was like really freaking cool. Cause he's like the first celebrity in person that I interacted with if you really like well he is a celebrity I mean if you, if I want to exclude people like voice actors oh wait I, I'll consider Kojima a celebrity because he's a celebrity in our eyes like gaming community so yeah I mean he'll be like I guess the second or third sense of like celebrity stat How does he fly fucking high and fucking get it? And fucking get it. Oh shit. I'm getting so irritated now. I really don't know what to do anymore. Um, he was buying some groceries with his kid and I I didn't even recognize that it was him until one of my co-workers was like, hey, hey, let me look. Does he, doesn't that guy over there look like Chris Rock? And I looked and he kind of did and I'm like, okay, maybe. Maybe it's one of those people who are one of those lookalikes. Because you always tend to have those people, you know? There's, I think there's like, a to apparently it's like a total of seven people who are going to look exactly like you. So... And, um, I was like, oh, yeah, it kind of does. She's like, and listen to him. Kind of sounds like him. Is 
Whoa, what? I didn't even land and I didn't even touch any buttons and like automatically got sniped. And Jesus' his ass or some shit. I don't know anymore. Damn, my throat hurts. And um, quite frankly, I, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna even lie. He came to my lane, and I treated him like a regular customer. I'm not gonna even lie to you, ladies and gentlemen. I said, "Hi, how are you? Do you have, you know, your your membership card?" He's like, "No." I'm like, "Okay, I'll put one for you." You know, I did give him respect. I did pack his stuff. Normally, I let customers pack their own shit. Because why the fuck am I going to pack your shit and I'm going to say thank you? And you're just expecting me to do it? In reality, I'm supposed to pack their shit. No ifs or buts, but you know, it's gotten to the point that I've gotten so sick and tired of people. And their stupid bullshit. Like, they want you to do everything for them. Like, pamper them out of their own asshole. And, um, I packed this stuff, so I'm like, okay, sir, you have a nice day. But the funniest thing was that when my co-worker, the one that pointed out that it looked like Chris Rock, when she came to, like, try to help me pack his stuff, she started laughing out of nowhere. I'm like, what's wrong with you? And she, she didn't want to, she, she just couldn't stop laughing. So she went away, she had to go in anyways. Cause she was in charge of self scan at the time and she had a whole bunch of customers there being a bunch of like dumbasses and all of a sudden i turn and i see some guy looking at chris rock like he like he's gonna rape the fuck out of him i'm like jesus fucking christ leave the poor guy alone like hit let him and this kid fucking shop in peace you know And then the guy is like, oh my god, you're my favorite actor. And Chris Rod is like, oh yeah, okay. Like, he, he, he just wanted to be in peace, you know. And I don't blame him. Sure, you know, that's what you sign up for whenever you're a celebrity. You want to do acting. Or you want to get into that sort of business, you know. Um... But, you know, if they're in public and they want to do, like, grocery shopping, leave them the fuck alone. And, and I'm saying this to everyone. I mean, if you're watching this video, leave celebrities the fuck alone. If they're fucking shopping, if they want to, like, pull boogers out of their ass cheeks, let them do it. Don't go and bother them. What if they want to have peace and quiet? They just want to look like a regular, normal human being like you and I who struggle in a daily base trying to make money or trying to make a living or trying to even survive with this shit money that we're getting. You know? They, be, they may be getting all these millions of dollars, but you know. And but at the end of the day, they just want to be normal at times. While having the tabloids or like having people follow the hell out of them. I mean, if you come out and you're like, hi, excuse me, you know. Or are very polite about it. I'm pretty sure they... Oh, shit, I forgot. I'm not supposed to walk left. I'm supposed to hop. Um. Yeah, like, if you know, if you're... If you're gonna go to them... Go to them in a nice manner and, you know, if you want to autograph or a picture or whatever, just ask them politely instead of looking like a complete rapist or sorts. And, like, you're gonna feast on their flesh and bone and, like, marvel the foots that they touch. I mean, the, the steps that they, you know, hit on the floor. With. I don't even know anymore. I, all I know is my throat's hurting. So I can't yell anymore. As much as I want to. And surprisingly, I'm very quiet right now. Despite all this bullshit that's going on in this fucking game. 
Um, yeah, you can definitely hear it, man. My, my voice is very hoarse now. From all the yelling earlier. From something that didn't even fucking go through. Yeah, so, you know, let's say if you were to meet President Obama. Not really much of a well, I guess he's technically, but not really a fucking celebrity. I mean, he's well known, obviously, because he's the president. But if you're gonna meet him and shit, don't go looking like you're gonna fucking rape the shit out of him. You know, he's like, hi, hi, how are you? How you doing? Like, he's a regular fucking person. Like, you would talk to your friend. Like, would you look at your friend like you're gonna fucking rape him? No. Cause that's straight up wrong. Shit. You know? So I'm like, okay, you have a nice day, sir. And I left him alone, you know? Now, I'm gonna be honest, like, I have this big huge thing with Angela Jolie and Brad Pitt. Now, if it, even if it was Angela Jolie and Brad Pitt, which is like my two most favorite actors, and everybody could like scream at me in the comments saying Angela Jolie is not an actress because she's been making shit movies. But at the end of the day, I like her, and I like Brad Pitt too. Um, even if I were to see them, I, as much as my inner my inner self would just scream and like have this complete like orgasmic moment and I see them I would just keep it cool you know I, I prefer leaving them the hell alone <sighs> yeah, so that was my 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 Saturday, my interesting Saturday. Oh, mind you, I wasn't supposed to work that day. I winded up having to switch my schedule with a coworker who always drops me off home every time. You know, we're getting off at the same time. So I was like, uh, she's like, oh, do you think you could do me a favor? And, you know take my shift for Saturday, I was like, eh, I didn't want to because my sa that was my Saturday off. And she's like, and I'll take your shift for Monday. I'm like, yeah, I guess. So that's what winded up happening. It was interesting. Okay, Blaze, I'm getting really, I'm, my throat is like killing me right now. But, um... Um, yeah, I think that's it, guys. My throat is really hurting. And I think I'm just gonna, like, see if I can find some cough drops or something to, like, soothe it out or something. I don't know. Drink some water. <laughs> like, I'm gonna drink water. Probably drink some juice. Yeah, maybe. Um, I guess that's it, everyone. So, um, it's hopefully a comeback for me and my channel. Um, I'm terribly sorry that I haven't uploaded anything except for the lightning uh, figure that I got which is like standing beautifully in front of my TV which I don't even use. <laughs> um, uh, the Tomb Raider videos and a couple of videos that I had pre like recorded and had it already on my channel just waited for me to upload them. Uh, yeah, just thank you for sticking by and thank you for everyone who's still subscribed and has been subscribing lately. Um, 
I'm at like 250. I'm a, I'm a little over 250. I think I have 251 subscribers. I really don't know anymore. Um, I try not keeping count because eventually those subscribers will go down, then it'll go back up, and you know, it's like this. Let's just say over 230 subscribers for the time being. But yeah, thank you everyone. Um, I'm like I said, I'm terribly sorry for for keeping you guys, you know. Not updated on what's been going on. I like I make videos explaining my situation, but every time I recorded it, it just sounded so bad. And yeah, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. So before I wind up losing my voice to the point that I can't tomorrow if I were to work because tomorrow's a snow day and it looks pretty bad. I don't, I don't know how many inches of snow we're gonna have again. We've been getting pummeled by snow left and right that literally my entire apartment complex is nothing but mountains of snow. Um, so I don't know if I'm gonna take the day off or something because I was those cat cost me on the leg to the fact that I need them on a snow day. So, I don't know, let's see what happens. Um, thank you, and um, I hope you all have a great and safe day. Bye for now.